Allow me to be frank at the commencement. You will not like me. No, I repeat you will not. The gentlemen will be envious and the ladies repelled. Now ladies, an announcement. I am up for it all the time. That is not a boast or an opinion. That is a bone-hard medical fact. I put it around, you know. And you will watch me putting it around and cipher it. Don't. It is a great deal of trouble for you, and you are better off watching and drawing your conclusion from a distance than you would be if you caught my arse pointing up your petticoats. Now, gentlemen, do not despair. I am up for that as well. <laughs> when the mood is on me. Still your cheesy erections till I've had my say. But later when you shag, and later you will shag, I shall expect it of you. And I will know if you have let me down. I want you to shag with my homuncular image rattling in your gonads. Feel how it was for me. Feel how it is for me. And ponder, was that shudder the same shudder he felt? Or did he know something more profound? Or is there this wall of wretchedness that we all bang our heads against in the shining live-long moment? That is it. That is my prologue. Nothing in rhyme. No protestations of modesty. I doubt you were expecting that. My name is John Wilmore, 2nd Earl of Rochester, and I do not want you to like me.